Welcome to hell. So first thing I want to do is go grab the beautiful one, the super shotgun, and then kill this arachnatron and this shotgunner. And let's see if we can get some infighting going. That would be kind of nice. Even if it's with just some annoying hit scanners. Because there's a lot of just infighting material in this starting room. Specifically, that Aragnatron would be nice. I think he might be targeting me. I might have accidentally hit him. Yeah. Let's... Okay, never mind. I was going to say let's stand in behind the Mancubus so he can get some damage on him. These chain gunners can be kind of annoying. They are like right be- Wow. 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 Okay, so in the <laughs> on the opposite side there's a rocket launcher. Wow. Okay, let's kill these hit scanners. They are relentless right now. There's a med kit right here, thankfully. And I ought to switch to the chain gun. That's okay. That was a lot of damage in, like, not even a second. Let's pick up some stim packs. There's a bunch of stim packs just lying around. And I think that might have been all the health. But that's okay. We don't really need too much for the upcoming part. Suppressing so this switch opens the wall and reveals... A horde of revenants. Just pump some rockets. Oh yeah, there's stim packs down here. And now, when you grab the red key, let's focus on this side. Rocket down a few pinkies. Get get over here. Kill this shotgunner so we can avoid the mancubus projectiles. And yeah, easy peasy. These revenants... Oh, I woke up the shotgunner. There's another shotgunner right here. I don't want to hit that switch quite yet. I want to deal with these revenants. Because when you hit the switch, it releases some enemies into the starting room. And what I want to do is not shoot. I want to focus down these chain gunners and this arch vial. But once you kill the Archvile, it's basically free. Maybe the Mank. The Revs. Just do whatever. You can get away with quite a lot. Just in the entirety of Vanguard, honestly. And I believe that is the first area done. Now we can open up the red door. And this is just a room that exists. I don't know why this is here, but it's here. And it exists. I'll just chain gun everything. SSG. The Hell Knights. There's a few Hell Knights in this area. Shotgunners. Actually, I'm going to go up right now because there's a chain gunner. And you get the plasma here. This is basically just a little, like... I don't know if this is the proper term. Also, we're just going to grab this. Since there's no berserk in this map, and I'm not never going to use it anyways. It's just in the way. I don't know if this is the right term for this, but it's kind of like a buffer room for the, uh, the next part. And I believe that is everything. So, let's move on to the outdoor area. So, this is probably the... Nah, not the hardest part. I don't know why I thought th would think this is the hardest part, but it can get pretty overwhelming. So focus down those arachnatrons because I want to use this ledge here as a bit of a platform to just rocket down stuff. And I didn't grab rockets. Um. Okay, we're gonna start moving around a little. Oh, there's more rockets right here. But yeah, this outdoor area is just flooded with enemies. If you're speedrunning, you can actually just ignore everything and go to the fights if you want to. We will use rockets on 
some of the more threatening f dudes, like... Ow. Like myself. <laughs> I'm the most threatening enemy in this arena. Fear me. I kinda wanna use rockets on, like, Manx and Arachnotrons that are perched. Like this guy here. This is getting a little overwhelming. I'm playing like garbage right now, by the way. <laughs> Uh, any more hit scanners? No. I don't see any. I think I'm gonna use a little bit of plasma. Just because. Speed things up a little. Maybe some more rockets now that they're all clumped together. There is quite a lot of ammo in this, uh, outdoor area. And I believe that's everything. Now we just have these, uh, sniper imps to deal with. There, uh, this is, uh, there are actually a few cell packs that I want that are guarded by two revenants that I just remembered, so we're not actually completely done. Oh, hello, Kako. Monster window dressing. I don't see the big idea with it. It's I I don't mind it personally. So two revenants, and your reward is two cell packs. And now it's time for the actual hard fights. Uh, I don't actually need health. We're gonna grab a mega sphere. We're gonna deal with this fight first since I think it's harder than the next fight. So. Drop down. Don't drop down straight in the center because there's a supercharge that you can easily grab. And what we're going to do is focus these Hell Knight. Just these Hell Knights. Stay a little close to them because there's some on the opposite side as well. You don't want them to be scratching at you. Try to maximize that splash damage. Kill as many as you can. Now it's plasma time because pinkies are going to start spawning. We're going to try our best to centralize them. Let's grab that supercharge. I took way too much damage. Let's switch back to rockets for a while. More enemies, but these are more Hell Knights. They're slow, so you don't really have to deal with them. You don't really have to worry about them as much. Wow, I'm taking way too much damage. Also some imps, chain gunners on the opposite side. So I don't really want to go over there. They can infight each other. And I think I'm going to switch over to SSG because... Oh, I didn't grab cells in the uh, outdoor area. Oh, that would have helped. Um, yeah, I, I'll, I'll just spare you guys the time. I'll just use plasma. If I have to pay the price in the next fight by using SSG, that's okay. And that is this fight. That went horribly, but <laughs> whatever. We survived and that's what matters. Let's grab these cells. I completely forgot about them. They are very useful. There's also some on the opposite end. And it's already time for the final fight. This area. This is a very fun fight. So I'm just going to grab as much ammo as I can carry before starting it up. And... Here's the deal. So, there's going to be three waves of enemies similar to the previous arena. All on the outside, so it's going to be kind of swarmed in this arena. I'm going to switch over to Plasma because Pinkies. Just for a little bit until I can safely switch back to Rockets, which is probably right now. And just keep rocketing the center a little. Okay, nice, 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 nice. Let me out? Wow. Can you stop? I'm going to just switch to plasma. This is awful. There's going to be more pinkies and revenants. 
Let's grab this supercharge. Let's see if we can get that armor as well. Nice. That went horribly. Okay, switch back to rockets just for a little bit. Because there's more enemies. Now switch back to plasma so we can plasma on the outside and get our nice circle strafe going. And then back to rockets. And this is these are the uh, last of the enemies. Plasma is definitely your best friend in this entire map in general. Just in life, actually. Praise Plasma. And we are done. I'm going to grab this supercharge for 100% items. Why not? But we can just go to the exit. We have all three keys. We are done. So yeah, that's a that's uh the start of the hell episode. It's very orange. <laughs> Not a uh typical depiction of hell for sure, but I dig it. I really like orange is a very underused color in just all new maps, so I really like it. And uh as you can see, it's quite a lot brutal than uh the other maps that have come before. So yeah. But Sadly, this episode is only really two maps. Next map is technically the final map of Vanguard. There is actually a map 13, but it's basically just a uh, thanks for playing map. And I am going to be playing that as its own separate video, because I don't really know why. <laughs> but yeah, who cares? Just end the video, Brendan. Thank you so much for watching, and have a good one.